Hey guys, what's up? This is me again here with another quick video. Um, so I finally broke down and got myself a little a uh, little nano system again. Decided I would do um, do this in a way where I'd be able to have coral again because I really miss having coral. What I did is I went down and I bought, hang on, I'll show you guys the box. It's an Evolve 8 by Aquion. Pretty nice little tank. Showing us uh, fresh water on there, but the light is strong enough for salt water. Um, what I did, as you see, you got a little crown on there. It's pretty cool. What I actually did is I actually took, I had to take sand in my tank too because you know, I uh, didn't have any small bags of sand, but took the water straight from there in the sand, my big tank. I have the lights off some killing algae right now which I have I'll show you at the, uh, at the end of the video I have pretty much uh, annihilated it it is gone now which makes me very very happy um, but here's the tank it's an 8 gallon it's made of acrylic I still have to get myself an acrylic uh, mag float um, but as you see right now I don't, have any, have any, I don't have any algae problems and I don't plan on having any algae problems um, soon I'm going to buy some snails and crabs and stuff so that was the the moonlights or the actinics whatever you want to call them here's daylight it's pretty bright there for a second see this is all live rock in here it's really cool I'm going to show you guys see if I can capture this on camera I actually got a piece of live rock let's see I think that switched, switched this day there we go if you look down in there I don't think you can see it yeah, I don't think you guys can see it. Um, I actually have a, um, some spots of red algae, of red coralline algae that actually glows underneath the actinics, which is really, really cool. Let's put this back over here. The only thing I really don't like about this is the switch doesn't like to stay. I don't know if it's because of the rubber housing, it's just making it so I can't push it down all the way yet, but I don't know. We'll see. What I really like is this, this piece of rock right here. This piece of rock is sick. Look at that. It's got this. Sorry for this clam on it. Nice size clam. I think it's probably oh three and a half to four inches in diameter. It's pretty awesome. Got my clownfish in there. I'm gonna get some, just a couple more fish in there. Get some coral in there. Because as as I just said earlier, I actually took this. Uh, the water out of my big tank, which is already cycled, so this tank is already all cycled. So I don't know. I'll put some coral in there soon, but first I'm gonna get some the cleanup crew in there. Get a couple, get a shrimp. I want to get a couple hermit crabs and snails and stuff in there. Um, I don't know. I might wait for a little, a little bit for some algae to grow um, before I put them in, but we'll see. I also want to put a starfish in there. It's a small one. I'm gonna get like a red one. Those are pretty cool. Um, I just going to come over here and look at my big tank. The water is a little bit low. Got to top it up today. I'm going to turn on the light. There we go. As you see, there's actually some salt, uh, the sands on the rocks. I have to take that off today. Just from last night when I set up the tank. I pretty much set up the tank and went to bed. Um, as, as you can see, there is still a little bit of the algae problem. But before, it was all over the sand, all over the rocks. It was terrible. Um, and finally, it's all gone away. It makes me very happy. Well, most of it's gone away. Got, I don't know if you guys have seen him yet. This is my orange shoulder tang. Great fish. I love him. He's very active. Him and my uh, lemon butterfly fish didn't get along very well at the beginning, but they are friends now, which is great. Um, still got the, uh, the blue green chromuses. Unfortunately, I have had a, a death in the tank. I've lost my um, flame angel fish, which really sucks because he was like my favorite one. If you can see back in there, I don't know you can. He just hid away, but I have a sh the shrimp. There he is. Shrimp's back there. Got a couple crabs. Same old stuff. I'm gonna try to get this canopy finished soon. We'll see, hopefully, in the next couple weeks. I don't want to keep saying that, but I don't really want to get it finished. Yeah, I love this fish. He's really colored up good. He's good five inches at least. 
great fish. Love him. So, if you guys have any comments, suggestions, anything, go ahead and post them down below. Thanks, guys.